for. That's a good looking super. Or where are your gloves? You aren't wear them? Okay, take your sharp blade in between you. Okay. Let me help you. Yeah. They've got her kind of stuck now, don't they? Yeah, I'm going to go get my gloves. You're going to go get your gloves? Mama has sent the little beekeeper to get her gloves. Better safe than sorry. We're here after work with Core Jean. We're feeling pretty confident it's time to pull the entrance reducer and add a super, take out a feeder. If you remember last, last check, which was her first inspection, found the queen, brewed, everything we needed to see. Um, told you then we weren't going to give them any more feed we didn't but we are going to remove the feeder today uh, it's it's rained here in Arkansas just almost continuously seems like we got to get this done get another super on them before we got about six more days of rain so Now you got her going, just take it out and lean it back up against the corner over there where it won't fall. Slide it, there you go, now just lean it back up against the... Okay, okay. Yeah. Um, so yep, just like that. Okay. You want me to run smoke for you? Oh, okay. Alright, you're ready. Spider, two spiders. That's okay. Spiders. No, spiders are free. Do they eat the bees? Nope. Black widows eat the bees. That's a good question. But what about the talk, big ones? Talk loud so people can hear you. What about the big ones? The... Just regular old spiders? Yeah. Not that I know of. Now remember, you're probably stuck out in the middle, so you're going to do what? Can I get this one? Yep, scrape that one off. There's a casualty of a lid closure. You're going to go on these two sides and then you're going to go in the center and raise straight up making sure you're not hung on frames as you look twist your tool twist there you go all right all your frames down okay i'm gonna give them a little smoke for you all right don't bang in or cover you got bees all under there i'm sure Okay, now if you'll flip it over. Let's let's have a look for that queen on this inner board. They have been some kind of busy, Cor. We are definitely not too early. Running right on time. I don't see any. All right, if you don't see one, lay it down. Don't don't lay it directly down the end there. Cross it. Yep. Okay, now here's what happens when feeder tanks in here open, they got a nectar flow coming. We never put feed back in it, but you can tell they got in there and started waxing because they needed this other frame. Remove your feeder. Go to the other end so you come up straight, it's just like a frame. Okay, just pinch it right there and pull it straight up. Yep. Can I do it? Yep. Straight up. Now, has it got, oh, look at the bees it's got. Okay. Now, I can see that comb down in there and I don't see 
any larva in it. I don't see her on your feeder. Mm -mm. So is that bad that they started? Nah, just something for us to have to clean up. All right, here's an important question. Are you gonna put a queen excluder down or are you gonna let her have run of this box? We're going to put the excluder You do want to? No. Okay, no. I thought you wanted them to roll. Yeah. All right, so let's lay this, Just you just hold that. Oh. I'll tell you what, you're doing this. Take your hive tool. Okay. Break this outside frame loose. This, this yep. one? Oh, I see they've been Scoot it, outside. yep. Be able to do everything gentle and calm. Okay, now get it and get it and lift it. I can see brood on my side. Straight up when you do it. Am I in your way? Oh. My goodness. Look at the brood lay quilted on there. Mm-hmm. What's on your side? More. More brood. Wall to wall. Okay. Um, here's what we don't really want to do, and I know you've got your hand full. I'm going to lay this down right here on your, on your box, okay? Okay. Don't smash him. I'm going to try not to smash anybody. I'm going to lay this down right here. let them start getting into that super now okay. what are we going to do we've brought a deep frame you, that's okay you need to put that thing in. all right but you got brood on both sides of that mm -hmm. i think she's putting the frame first yeah. so you want to do this i'm just kind of messing up your program is that what you're saying mm -hmm. and so we're going to put the new frame right here well are we going let's to do i tell you what let's do hang no. that one up Okay, now it's got brood on it. We know that. Mm -hmm. We didn't see the queen, so we she may be there, she may not be. Well, let's go to this frame. Oh, just be gentle. Be, no, you're all right. Now make sure you're not stuck here and lift that one straight up out of there. Okay. Have you have to. Okay, now what are you what are you seeing on that frame? Uh, fresh comb. Okay. And fresh comb being worked on. You see, I see honey being put in it. So the nectar flows on yes. when they can get to it. Now, can if if you'll let me help you. Okay. Here's what I want to help you with. You've identified no brood in this, just honey, and they're working on that, yes. right? Yep, comb and honey. Okay. Comb and honey, comb and honey and bees. Plenty and so of that, plenty of all. That really white stuff. That is fresh. That fresh. Comb. You bet, and that's fresh nectar and honey being put in. All right, so let's move it over here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, let's take this brood. Can I put it right here for you? Yep. Okay. Okay, now lift that frame. Okay. Remember that. There you go. The heel of your tool. That way, yep. you should get to that's that. That's exactly frame. right. You got a place for your tool to rest. Okay. Now. Let's inspect it and see if you got brood in it or honey and pollen or what we've got, okay? So normally the queen would probably be in one of these. Well, open. We hope so. So we have some fresh comb over it. That's okay. right. And see how they're laying that up there like they are? Yeah. Is it? And like they're not bringing it on down deeper and heavier? Mm-hmm. More than likely. 
they're going to let her lay there. Okay? They're putting the honey up above. And they're coming on down. All right, but but the right there is your mama. See her right there? She is laying. I just can't see the eggs. See her going right there? Coming to you. Come on towards me. There, looky there. Okay, now she's laying on this. Yes. So we're kind of in that situation. We got a call to make. We're going to go ahead and leave as is. We're going to move to the wall. Will that mess her up? No, she's laying eggs. They got enough bees, they'll move over and cover them. Mm -hmm. We're gonna move her to the wall. Okay. Now, put your extra deep frame that we brought right in there. Okay. That way, will they work on this next? That's it. Will they move? Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, we know she's over here. We know this is just foundation. They're going to figure that and start pulling comb. Mm -hmm. Okay? So that means we know we got brood, 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 brood. Mm -hmm. And we made a buffer with our our honey. Mm -hmm. All right? So that's going to be bunches of bees when these all come come tearing out of here, right? You need to have to. So let's just kind of look right here. So we know that they're not... Okay, so you get you've had a bunch of a bunch of bees hatch. You still got bees hatching. Okay, so we've caught these just in time. They're not they're not congested. They still got room to spread out. If you'll take your hive tool and clean up some of this burr comb, it's time for you to add your box. So why do they build it up on top? Well, they they've got a lot coming in. They're getting close to having a lot of their work done, but a lot of this comb was started when they were in the nuke box. So once it's kind of started, they just keep adding to it. Okay. Uh, do you want me to get off that? We will just as soon as you put this other box on. Okay. Where do you want me to put it? Just pick it up and it goes straight on top. Nah, nah, just leave your feeder. You're okay. On top of it? Yep, just leave it set. Okay, and stand right here and grab the front side handle. Yeah. Great. Doing good. No, nope, you're there. good. Man, that's a pretty box. Are we just going to shake them? Yeah, just going to shake them. Can I shake them? Yep. Okay. So when will we put a clean it? Well, now when they fill this one out, we'll put you a clean excluder on and try to catch you some honey. Okay? okay. But we're going to just let her have this box. Okay, so that's just All right, now, just, just now hold on. When you do this, you're, you're doing a mid-air stop so when you come down you're going to stop above the frames don't bang them onto the frames okay. it'll take a little little good little jolt like that yep They don't like what you got going. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Now, you got a whole pile of them in here. What are we gonna do with them? Shake them. All right, let's shake them on the grass so we don't hurt anything, okay? Mm -hmm. You wanna do it? Nope. <laughs> you got those floats in there that are gonna come up yeah. too. Okay. Got that taken care of. Now, set your inner lid just like it is up here on top. Cross it. Yep. All right. You just break it loose. I'll pick it up. Side to side, cut it right off there. safely stay there in your hand. Your hive, remember, I'm just a helper. Okay, you ready to flip it over and line it up. Always go a little further and drag back. Okay. All right. I'll try to clear beans and you can put your top on. Put your brick back, she'll fly in a minute. We'll leave it outside, she'll come home.
Yeah. We'll pick it up too. All right, let's let's tell everybody kind of what what went on. This was Cora's second inspection. We had told you from the first inspection everything you saw, everything that happened. She had her second box ready. She put her frames in it. We come out. She went through it. We just happened to find the queen laying on some fresh comb. Uh, we moved them over. There'll be enough bees to, to go over on that frame with her and take care of any eggs that she's got laid. They'll, the, all that'll be fine. This has got a great population of bees. We dropped in that number nine frame and foundation between two they're working on. She added her box. She got bees out of her feeder. Um, all in all, everything went well. She cleaned up burr comb. Uh, her next inspection now doesn't have to be for 14, 16 days. I mean, it can, it can be an easy two weeks. Uh, all is well. We got weather coming. They've got space brood coming off, more bees coming, nectar coming when it's not raining. Uh, she's doing a great job so far. Is there anything you want to add, Cor? Nope. We covered it. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, let them know till we see them again. Roll that view of bee footage. Thanks for watching. All right, grab your feeder and we'll have mommy watch them chocolate away. <laughs>